Hello everyone! So, today is a pond fishing video. Before the video gets started, subscribe to this channel, click the dingling, and make it go bling bling. Alright? Now, this is a pond fishing video. Originally, was gonna go boat fishing, but some jackars um, parked right in front of my boat on the street, even though there's two blocks that he could have parked. Um, you know, could have just at least gave me 10 feet and I could have got the boat out, but and instead he parked right on the trailer hitch, and there's already a truck that's parked every day right behind it, so couldn't get the boat out. Decided to go pond fishing instead, and also got their pitch black. Um, caught one like second cast on a whopper plopper so you probably won't be able to see anything in that but I, I kind of tried to get some light on it we'll see how it looks but don't worry that's the only thing and then you'll be able to see all the other fish caught and then afterwards I'll tell you how I caught them and why so let's get out on the water finally alright you probably can't see it uh, there you go. All right. Dude, it's crazy. <laughs> Little dude. Stumpy, little fucker. Stop. Stop. Little dude. Not smaller than the first one. And you know he's there. Pooped all over me. Another little dude.
not super small, not as small as the other one, but he had this sink of choked. But we got it out of him. He's not bleeding. He's good to go. I almost just got shit on by freaking dudes. Jeez. <laughs> wow. Another one that I didn't know was on there. One face better. Beard bass and baits. one of the day. Smallest one of the day. <laughs> Jesus. 
that's another good one. Sorry, bro. Jesus fucking crying. Okay, there we go. Dropping, but he's fine. Another stick bait fish. They are spunky. The steak. You idiot. <laughs> Come here. Little dude. Little dude. Oh, yep. Yeah. Not getting bigger like I thought. All right. So, there you have it. Um ended up being a good day bank fishing. I caught what, eight, nine, and maybe two hours. I uh, caught one on a whopper plopper, like second cast of the morning. It was still super dark outside, so um, hopefully you guys saw that. But then after that, no more bites on the whopper plopper. Tried a couple different things. I literally took like no tackle. I took three rods. I took a top water rod with a plopper tied on. I took a cranking rod with a spinner bait tied on. And I took a spinning rod with a stick bait tied on. Redbeard bass and bait. But anyway, tried the spinner bait, never got a bite, and decided to say screw it and threw in this little fellow right here. This is the Red Beard Bass and Baits, the stick. And there's a reason why it does not have a stupid fancy name, and it is simply called the stick, because you do not need another stick bait. Okay, that's Colorado Magic Color. Make these in almost everything. It is my special, awesome, amazing color. I don't know how much of you can see of it, actually, with the green screen. Don't worry, I'll put pictures up. But, <laughs> anyway, um, why this steak bait is so much better, and I'm tired of talking about it, so much, is all these idiots that are making steak baits now, they're just making Sankos, okay? And they want to talk about, oh, look how much salt content is in our Sanko compared to a Yamamoto Sanko and blah 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 they're making the exact same effing thing that everyone else is making okay but there are different ways to make baits there are ways to make baits better I, this is all on my website I talked about all this all the time this is on the 
the bait website. I put my heart and soul into making baits better and making new concepts and new style baits. Everyone else is just doing the same crap recirculated all the freaking time. I'm tired of it. Okay, so why is this one better? You say? Well, you're just playing a bunch of crap. It is made lighter. It's made slicker. So that is a more finessey presentation. This is what I wanted to make a stick bait out of. I wanted it to be more finessey. I know you're like, wait, stick bait is super finessey. I wanted it more so. I wanted a slower fall. That might not be for all of you. I also wanted it slicker and softer so the fish because if you've ever seen a if you've ever gotten a bite on a worm or a stick bait whatever the fish sucks in that bait okay so I want it to I want that hook when it's made weightless Texas rig or even with the weight just Texas rig style I want that hook to get that fish a lot better it's just gonna poke right through that bait so fast and it's gonna get a great hook set into them and also they can swallow the thing because it's nice and slick and slimy and gross but seriously I'm not screwing around try one of these try all the baits I'm not joking around with you um, they're made different for a reason and you get them and you'll notice so anyway and this is Colorado magic color amazing color I'll see you guys on the next one.